Kenya's impressive performance at the World Martial Arts Mastership has been recognized by President Uhuru Kenyatta, who congratulated them for the two gold and two silvers and five bronze medals. The positive numbers are as a result of hard work and consistency. Michael Kinney in Korea with that story. For a sport that is not very popular in the country, Tong Il Modu was the only sport out of 20 in the world martial arts that is representing Kenya in Korea at the World Martial Arts Masterships. Tong Il Modu is a combined martial arts and is divided into three sections. Sparring is the most common where you score points by kicking, punching, grappling or ground fighting. Then there is forms and special techniques as well. The 2019 performance is much better than the first edition Kenya took part in in 2016. Uh, well, the advantages we had is, uh, number one, we got here in time, and then we've had uh, different training programs for a long time, and by the time we, left, we came to Korea, we had, uh, we had an internal uh, training camp. Coach Hilary Wahanda has been the man training the team, guiding them through each and every individual match. They have to trust him to call the shots when in action. Uh, you know, when a player goes in the ring, uh, we simulate like I am in the ring. So they look for an opportunity and I also assume I'm the one competing. If I see an opportunity, I direct them to score. Players are required to learn all three sections of the game, but it is not easy to find a single player that is good in all three. In most cases, they are able to get a participant who can be multi-talented and can play in sp and forms, sparring and special techniques. And these are the kind of people we usually wish to develop further because we know this one can perform in all these categories and also be able to train more people in the future to be able to win for our country. The Federation is planning to bring in special techniques trainers to Kenya to assist the players with their deficiencies. Michael Kenyi for Citizen TV in Seoul, Korea.